Hey, Anna. Yes? Hold this. Sure. Hey, Ed. Hi. Hold this. Oh, okay. And I, I don't want to pressure you because I know this is hard, but are you ready to go over to the cemetery? Yes, of course. I'm ready. I haven't been here in a long time. These are my parents. I didn't know they were here, too. My mother died when I was a young girl. After that, everything was different. My father started drinking. I was so scared of him. I try not to think about those days. A year after my mother's death, he fell down our basement stairs and broke his neck. Anna. I hoped that I could live with Uncle Javi. I was very close to him, but he disappeared from my life after my father died. I was raised by my grandparents. My father and Uncle Javi had one other brother, Angelo. Here he is. He died before I was born. I don't even know much about him. Was his middle name Key? No, it was... it was Ray. The stone is worn. Could that be the clue? Your uncle holds the key? I don't know. Well, it's all we've got. We'll have to figure it out by the time we get to the vault. Ed, thank you for coming here with me. I... You're welcome. We should go. Thanks for trusting me enough to take me. It means a lot. It felt good to finally talk about my family with someone. There you are. We've been waiting. So, did we find it or what? I think so. Using the lab's thermal scanner and the information from Tortoise, I found what I think is the vault's location. It's in the tunnels beneath the lab's decommissioned super collider. Far underground. So how do we get in? There are several service and ventilation shafts that go from the surface down to the super collider. Using the blueprints, I was able to find one that should get us close to the vault room. It's here. Not far from here. The super collider passes underground. 
The lock looks pretty old. We should be able to break it and climb down. Climb? So this is it? Almost. Come on. Let's get this over with. What is this? We're in a service tunnel underneath Juno's old super collider. The vault room should be a hundred meters down this hallway. How do we get through? I didn't know the way would be blocked. They must have been using the crates to salvage pieces of this collider for the newer one. We'll have to find a way to move them. Move them? This particle accelerator used powerful magnetic fields to bend the trajectory of highly accelerated particles. We should still be able to start up the magnets in the ceiling to clear a path. Damn it, Ed, was that even in English? Us use big magnets, box go to sky. Do we still need this mope? Yes. I hurt my shoulder when I was a kid. Accident with a truck motor and a climbing frame. Long story. Anyways, having a metal shoulder around powerful magnetic fields is a bad idea. You three will have to clear a path for me. So, I'll hold anything you're carrying in case it's got metal in it. You mean my gun? Yeah, that sort of thing. Under no circumstances does an officer hand anyone else his weapon. I'm staying with Ed. Here, you can hold everything I'm carrying. To tell you the truth, I'm a bit weighed down too. All right, the magnetic fields are highly focused and only affect the marked areas. Bennett and I can't be in one of those sections while the magnet is on, but you two should be fine. We'll support you however we can. Mr. Uh, detective, sir? Hmm? Come with me, please? All right. Excuse me, uh, Detective Bennett? Hmm? Wait here, please. All right. Excuse me, Anna. Yes? Follow me. All right. What can I do for you? Can you wait here? Yeah, okay.
Hey, you. What's up? Let's go. Yeah, okay. Sorry, detective? Hmm? Come with me, please? All right.
Excuse me, Ray. Yeah. Come with me, please. Sure. Now that we're past the magnets, can we have our things back? Fine. 